Welcome back to the bonus lecture of 10 minutes to Tableau Mastery. Before I begin talking about creating next level graphs and uh, expanding your Tableau and data visualization skills, I just want to mention how to change the title of the storyboard, which unfortunately I forgot to cover in the last video. Uh, to change the title, just double click on story one and type this as D's winter gear. I had this in the final result and so I wanted to show it to you guys on how you can do this so let's change this to 28 and uh, center this bold it and change the font to mv bully and again this is more of a personal preference you can choose whatever is it that you like all right so creating uh, good graphs or very professional graphs that help you um, help solve the business problem so in order to create graphs that make most business sense I think the most difficult part is understanding the business problem and getting that right question for which the business user needs your answer so which is which is pretty much the most difficult part in my opinion and uh, just a second let me get rid of the Dell update here and uh, I think I think the solution to that is practice, practice, practice. You just got to get yourself exposed to more problems and uh, try and try and read out different solutions. Which brings me to the third point: is exposure. Just just going through different Tableau public profiles and doing a lot of online courses, official Tableau training, getting yourself Tableau certified. It it'll just help you get exposure to different data science problems and. Uh, I feel that it's all about exposure, just learning and uh, looking at, you know, the best practices that are, or, or, or the things that have been taken up or just created by different people. The second most difficult part is data transformation. So when you get the right business problem, transforming the data into that form is also important and taking care of time. It, it would make it would absolutely make no sense for the business user to have a, a fantastic visual if it takes like five minutes to load so we need to have graphs that are fast enough and uh, the the transformations that you're doing within tableau or the way you're importing and visualizing the data should be such that it loads up fast and doesn't take up too much time. This is where the concept of tidy data comes into picture. So make sure that you have your data in a tidy format where the computer can understand it and visualize, visualize it in different ways. And uh, the other point that uh, I, I, I want to talk about is color theory. We covered a little bit about it, which reduces cognitive load. For example, uh, using the color of blue and red for temperature. So another example would be I personally use green for money as green just signifies money. And the final thing that I want to talk about is just play around with the interface. We we covered a ton of topics uh, in, in just about 30 minutes of the series. And just feel free to get your hands dirty. Just go ahead and do it. Just ex especially things, advanced functionalities of Tableau that we did not cover, like window functions, more table calculations, and there's many other Tableau functions which you can just explore and see what can help you. So many a times I've, I've noticed that there are certain Tableau functions that can, that can just do so much for me and which which might you know and i might have a hard time doing them by myself so those are really helpful and that's about it guys if you have any more questions do let me know in the comments section below i would like to congratulate again and thank you personally for going through this series with me so far i hope i could help you a bit with uh, learning tableau and uh this is it. Thank you so much. I've had awesome fun creating the uh, these videos for the series. I'm very excited to uh, come up with more videos and write more articles. So stay tuned. I There's more to come. There's always more to come. So thanks a lot, guys. This is me signing off. Thank you. Bye.